Hello and welcome back to Crackpot Sports. Got a strange story. It's really not a baseball story, but it is since it happened in a stadium. I was a little shocked when I first heard about it. A couple last night in Toronto at the Rogers Center was caught having sex up on the in the stands, but up on the top of the stairs. Now, my first thought was, were they hot? No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding, of course. No. But they're having sex at the stadium in public. Now, someone had caught it on film, filmed the act, and I guess they alerted security. Security actually went up there to tell them to stop. They were asked to leave the stadium. Uh, I don't think anything happened to them. Because Canada, it's like, hey, you know what? We figure you just made a mistake. You know, they're, they're just so nice up there. They said, it's okay. We don't mind. Uh, but next time I go to a baseball game, I'm going to pay attention to the vendors because it's going to be Peanuts, Cracker Jacks, condoms. Because this is getting crazy. Because a week ago, in Oakland, there was a couple and one of the, the female was performing a sex act on the male. No one alerted police until after the game, so they're still looking for him. But I'm kind of thinking, okay, Oakland's struggling, struggling to get fans in the stands. Maybe this could be an offer? It'd sell out every night? Of course, I'm just kidding. As an older person, you know, one of my younger days, I was like, ah, well, who, I don't care. I don't care. You know, before I got married, I had kids, all that stuff. Now I got grandkids. I don't want my grandkids seeing that. They don't have to see that at their age. Come on, people. We know you get the urge. And uh, to be fair, they were both at the very top, but some people did see it. Go to, out to your car. Go in, Go somewhere else. Get a room somewhere. Go home. Are the games that boring? I mean, I get it. I get it. Still, again, you get the urge. You get you. You want to. You want to do what you want to do. And I know I'm sounding like an old folk. I'm sounding like a boomer because I am a boomer technically. So let me know what you think in the comment section. Are you cool with this? Should there be a huge punishment for this? I mean, I don't know what you would do to them. I mean, maybe a huge fine. But I, I know personally, I don't want to go to a game with my grandkids and have to see that and have to explain to them what's going on. That's up to their parents to tell them, okay, what's going on. But if I'm taking them to the game, I don't want to have to explain it. That's all we got. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, tell a friend, all that fun stuff. We'll be back later on. Bye, everybody.